Hey guys, so today we're going to talk about computer specs and how it relates to music production. So let's fire it up. So first off we have CPU. CPU stands for Central Processing Unit. And by the way, this is not your CPU. This is your case. That's what a case looks like. Your CPU actually looks like this. Your computer case holds your motherboard, which is where your CPU is installed on. So as you can see, a CPU is actually pretty small. It's probably a little bit bigger than an average coin, say like a quarter, and a little bit smaller than a silver dollar. The sizes vary, but that's basically your CPU. So the point of the CPU is to actually receive commands that you give it process those commands and then send you back results. So you definitely want a processor that's gonna do that very fast and very efficiently. So there's tons of processors out there. And lately over the last probably five or seven years, they started having the dual core processors and quad cores and a lot of people get confused by what it all means. So basically when you talk about like a dual core processor, it's kind of like how your brain processes stuff on one side of the brain separately from the other side, kind of like multitasking. So with the dual core processor, you'll have two cores within the processor that's handling multiple jobs, which would be at your advantage if you are using DAWs because they have a lot of programs within programs, little plugins, which are programs inside your program, a lot of different screens, the MIDI edit window, the audio edit window. You have all these extra screens where all these processes are being calculated. You can look at it this way. If you were carrying a log, it'll be easier if two people are carrying the log rather than one. Even though one person can carry the log, it'll be more efficient if two or maybe four people are sharing that load and carrying the log. Also, you can look at it as if you're cleaning a house one person can clean the whole house, but it'll be more efficient if you have four people doing different rooms at the same time, basically multitasking. So when you're looking at a CPU, you wanna definitely try and get something that's dual core, quad core, maybe six cores or even eight. At the time of this video, I think they have up to 10 core processors. So based on what you need and based on what your budget can handle, you wanna definitely look into cores how many cores does your cpu have and how much workload are you going to be throwing at it so that's a little bit about understanding cpus you won't have that problem of trying to load your beat a couple months later and samples are missing because they'll all be in here and you can actually load the file from the zip file where you're not just choosing three different sounds that's very strong in the mid range and you're not bringing any other sounds in that's strong in the low range or in the high range. Your mix is very off balance. It has a lot of mid tone. The ability to export an OMF file. Now OMF stands for open media format. And what an OMF file is gonna help you do, it's gonna help you transfer your session from one DAW to another DAW. <laughs> 